action. You got to do a. Hey, uh... Welcome back. And it sounds awesome, though. It does Every sound time awesome. they play that chant, it's like very Halo esque. Oh. It's like the, just a high pitch. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. The like lamentations or whatever the fuck you want to call it. The chants. Yeah. The th and then they got the throat ones. They're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dune, if you didn't know what we we're talking about, I should just sand. I don't like sand. Would have been what it's called. And that's the name of the fucking sand. Thing. It gets Dune. It's coarse and it gets. So I I like it. I always heard it was it was Star Wars, Diet Star Wars. People it's Diet were, Star Wars. But it's I Star like Wars it. if they just stayed on Tatooine. Right. Yeah. And you have like the the the, the chosen one who yeah. is You were the chosen one being born into it's save. Wars. It's Star Wars. It's, Star it's Wars. the Jesus stories. It's a little it's... bit of uh, Avatar thrown in there. He has to assimilate into this culture. The culture. Yes. You know, and like learn their ways. It's it's a lot like that. And or it, Avatar is like Dune, you know, okay. whatever you want to say. And, and yeah. If you've never read the books, I would absolutely recommend watching the movie first and then reading it because I've heard from like super, super fans that it's Watch worth the movie first. Watching the movie to give you some kind of Reference, yeah. frame of reference. If you're just trying to, if I was, I just started reading the book, and if I just picked it up out of nowhere, I'd be like, like what you were saying earlier, like I don't know what any very of this George R. R. Martinish. So it's, I'm assuming because it's so accurate to the book that it's a yeah. lot of description, and there's a lot of his own language thrown in there because he's creating. If you want to build a world, you got to create your own language. You know what I mean? And like if I was just reading that and didn't know what a right. Fremen or a Har Harkonnen, I would have pronounced it is, or whatever, you Har know, the Harkonnen. Freeman. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah. the, the, Fre the, the Freeman. The Freeman. Fre the Freeman. The Freeman. Frey. The Freeman. Yeah, yeah, the Freeman. Yeah. Get it? Get it? The <laughs> wordplay? It's a fake laugh. <laughs> it's real! <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, you definitely need to watch the movies to contextualize what happens in the book. And you get a lot more reading the book because you get like he writes a lot of their it's like inner thoughts. It's one of those rare thoughts. ones where yeah. you get they actually work well together. Like normally one is vastly better than the or, other. Or yeah. Or they're this, both garbage. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I, I'm glad we have something other than Star Wars. Truly, I am. But it does feel Star Warsy. You have like the chosen Luke Skywalker dude who has to go take down the Emperor, and you know, you know there's an Emperor. It's, it's Star Wars. There's a chosen one and an Emperor. This is before Star Wars, though. The book came out in like '69. Was it '60s? Yeah. Oh, wow. So yeah. So Star Wars ripped off. Okay. So because I mean, he literally has like the Force power. Use the inner voice. Star Wars ripped off Dune. George Lucas ripped off Frank Herbert. Fucking, I'm just saying, he did. It's yeah, literally, see, Star Wars is just Dune. I remember being little and watching the original one with uh, dude from Flintstones. Kyle MacLachlan. Yeah. And the only thing that stuck in my head was the box. Like, put your hand in the box. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah. And that's the only reference as okay. a little kid I could remember. Then when that, like, that first movie is the, the, the whole book, right? Like, it's not broken up. No, or I guess it is. Oh, the original. The, the yeah, 1984 I, I, movie. No, I think it's the first half, and they just never made the other half. Oh. <laughs> I think, if I remember right. That's it where my frame of flop. reference came from. Everyone's like, this movie sucks. So in my head, I'm like, oh, all of Dune must suck then. Right? right? Like, like, it has its defenders and people who love it because it's a cult movie, but I'm it sure. definitely did not do well no. when it came out. I liked the original, this Dune, 2021 Dune. Um, not when it came out, though. Because it I was did like, not. We were even if we had the channel going or getting ready to the channel, we weren't. We, we were both like, eh, it was all right. I only watched it because it dropped day one on Max. On Max. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it was good. It was all right. I don't want to spend too much time talking about a movie that had nothing happen yeah, in it. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's it's just this a entire movie is all set up to to go see the second one, like. It literally ends, the first one ends with like Zendaya, only the beginning. who's only been in it for five minutes at this point, goes, this, this is, is only, only the beginning. beginning. And you're like, oh, no, you I, got, I got time, you can tell me now. <laughs> what you don't know is, that was her repeating back to the director, and they cut off her saying, what do you mean, comma? <laughs> this is only the beginning. Why would I say that? Why would I say that? <laughs> yeah. Like, what do you, why would I say? Desert power, roll credits. You got the guy riding the sandworm? Roll credits, baby. I'm like, hey, I was watching that. That's all you need. I just, mm. I, I wanted to see all that shit. I didn't need you to sp spend fucking 30 minutes them leaving their planet only to get to Arrakis just to then to, fight Harkonnen. Just to die immediately. Just to die immediately. And then he's like, ah, he's in the desert with his mom. I'm like, what is this movie? Yeah. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> so I didn't like the first one. I'd give the first one probably a six out of 10 because okay. it's like, that's not how you make a movie, unless you're making a second one. You know See, what I, mean? I know that's hard because I didn't watch the first one until I knew I was going to go watch the second one. And yeah. looking at it that way, I really dug it because I wanted to see more. Like, give me more because you're giving me like, and here's one in a minute. Ooh, piece of candy. 
Ooh, a piece of candy. <laughs> oh, you like that, didn't you? You see the bag, but you can have another, another M&M? Yeah. And you're like, wow, give me a bag of M&M. M&M. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So like, well, I was like, oh, this movie sucks. Because on its own, yeah, it sucks. Because like, you have to really like reading and like st- long stories and things that you don't mind plotting. Like said, it's plotting all a set up. Long. Yeah. It, it's if you're rough. looking for zoom, zoom, lightsaber explosions, 10 minutes, you're not getting that. Yeah. The first 20 minutes of the movie is the ship slowly landing while the dad is talking to everyone else about <laughs> how they should react when they get down here and they're having whole conversations and they're talking and then it lands and then everybody's walking slowly and they're like, so you this gotta is like, it, right? And you're like, you're going to need to do a lot of listening in this first hour and a half. And then we're going to give you some Fremen shit where he's going to fight one dude and then the movie's going to end. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It sucks. The first one is not good. I'm going to still give it a seven because I saw it different than you. You did. I did. On its own. I enjoyed it. But I did. Good, I knew but... watching it going, man, if you don't have patience, if you're like a lot of younger people, yeah. just from like 35 and under. It's very slow. You're like, I need a hundred very, more things to happen. It's very methodical. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like you're going to get up and like walk around your chair like 18 yeah, I need times. To, I need to hit pause. Yeah, right. I need to go do something, anything. It should be a show. It's another yeah. one we talk about. Yep. Should have been High a series. High budget Game of Thrones style, 20 million an episode. Give me eight episodes. Yep. Yeah. I, I, then you can take a break every hour. you can hour, spend like, as much yeah. time as you want. You can do everything from the book at that point. Yep. Yeah. So six out of 10, seven out of 10. I'd recommend watching it because it's the gateway to the second one, which is way better. Yeah. So a review coming soon for that. Right after this, I would imagine. And now. Well, (laughs) cut. I think with the Netflix show that came out. The Dragon Knight. Yes. Which I believe is set in a different Kung Fu Panda universe. No, it's this one. I don't think so. Oh, it's not supposed to be? be, They call him the Dragon Master. And he's the Dragon Warrior, and he's been the Dragon Warrior in every single movie. So I think there's a multiverse of Kung Fu Panda movies. And that's like... The, 